Hello, Ashley from Impress here. And today I just want to give you a quick video to show you how to set up and install CoverageBot for your video game. CoverageBot is a tool that I've built that helps you track your game's coverage across the web, YouTube and Twitch. I don't want to go too much into how and why that's useful in this video, but I'll just let you know that all the links to CoverageBot are down below. Let's get stuck into it. First, sign up with your Discord account or by email. You'll need to verify your email address by clicking on a link that you're sent. After you're logged in, you'll input your company details and afterwards add your subscription. Select your currency from the list and input your promo code if you have one. It's cheaper to pay for a year upfront. Most indies will be okay on the indie tier, but popular games or agencies who want to generate downloadable coverage reports or track their backlinks should select the next tier up. After you've input your card details and set up the subscription, you can create your game. To add your first game, use the game search tool. If your game doesn't show up in the results, you should try to add it on IGDB. In the meantime, you can add the game manually. Please use the exact and full game name and input your store pages and websites for additional tracking. The more, the better. After you've added your game, you should enable the platforms and trackers that you are interested in. In all of these sections, you can specify filters like minimum subscribers and so forth. To finish setting up tracking, add any general extra terms like hashtags and any blocked terms such as games, bands or other products with similar names to yours and click save. After you're set up, all the boxes are ticked, coverage will come through to the dashboard within a minute or so. Now lastly, we'll set up the Discord bot integration. If you didn't sign up using Discord, you'll need to link your Discord account. Once your Discord is linked, you should see a list of your servers in the list. If your server isn't listed here, you'll need manage server or admin permissions on the server to install the bot. Select a server. With the bot now joined in your Discord, you can prompt the setup by typing CB exclamation point in it. This will change to a slash command in the future. This will set up a coverage and coverage moderation channel. And if it doesn't set up any of these channels, then there will be one of two issues. You will need to move the bot closer to the top of the role list, like so, and you will need to make sure your server has a two-factor authentication requirement. After you've enabled this, prompt the bot with the command again, and it should all work. If you would like to route coverage to multiple channels, as in the demo on the product website, you can create the channels in your server and then update the configuration on the dashboard. If any of this doesn't work for you, please reach out to support on our Discord or see the knowledge base on the website. Your coverage bot is now set up and you will receive stream and coverage alerts in your Discord. Hooray! Please subscribe for platform updates, new marketing tools and shared knowledge on how to get your games noticed. Thank you. I accidentally knocked something off my desk before recording this whole video. This microphone wire here kind of flung to the left and this is what happened. The toast time guy is destroyed. I'm so annoyed. It's the last thing I wanted to happen. Ah, I'll have to fix it. It'll be on my desk in the next video. Not that you missed it.